Hi and welcome, I'm Jason Barnard, I'm the Brand Serp Guy and today we're looking at the Brand Serp for Tristan Thompson, who I didn't know but is apparently a professional basketball player. Now, what I wanted to focus on here is the lack of control that he has over his own Brand Serp. Now we'll start on the left hand side, we've got all these news stories, a lot of news stories, there's a lot going on in his life at the moment it would seem, and then we have more news his Instagram account, which is pretty much the only thing he actually has, then these videos, which are not by him, but they're about him, his Wikipedia page, you know, the Daily Mail talking about him, the news talking about him, and so on and so forth. That's all news about Tristan Thompson, Thompson, whose name I had almost forgotten. And if we look over on the right-hand side, all of this information is being pulled from the sports sites that uh, he's associated with. And he's got his three profiles, so he could potentially have more control. But you can see here, Google is using Instagram as his entity home. He probably doesn't have a personal website. That means that he doesn't have any real leverage on this brand SERP in order to try to control it a little bit better when news is breaking like this and totally dominates it. And it's a great tip for people, especially famous people, who are likely to have these bursts of news around them, to have an entity home that they own, i.e. a site that they own and can control 100%, because it gives them some leverage over the content of that brand SERP during the burst of news that they get. Thank you very much, and I'll see you soon.